Mix again. Thank you for clicking on this video and welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday to you. Let me know how your Monday is going because we all know Monday is many people's least favorite day of the week. Um, so let me know how your Monday is going or is it the same as every other day because you're staying inside like me. Either way, let me know how it's going. So I am so excited because this week we are kicking off our Eurovision bottom 10 week. Excuse me. We just ended last week with our reactions to second and first place, which were Turkey and Germany for 2010. So go check those out if you haven't, because those were great videos. And we are beginning the bottom 10 this week by reacting to, let's see, 10th from the bottom was 30th place. And 30th place at Eurovision 2010 was the country of Poland. Hey, Poland, I feel like I haven't seen y'all for a little while. I'm so excited to be reacting to Poland again. You know I love Poland and Eurovision. Um, I love the 2020 entry and I love a lot of their entries before that. So I can't wait to react to this. The song is called Legenda, I think. I think it's a hard G, right? Legenda, not Legenda. And the artist is Marcin Rosinski. So let's go ahead and get into this. Super reacted to, super excited to react to Poland, because again, y'all know I love Poland. So let's see what Poland was bringing for Eurovision 2010. I really like the backing singers, they sound great. in Polish? Was that part in Polish? I hope so. <laughs> this stage looks like so deep, but I think it's just the way the lights work. This one has a great voice. So he's like, I don't care if you don't want me. We're going to be together. Oh, oh my God. Why is he killing her? <laughs> Why is he choking her? I like how it shifted to red though. That actually was pretty good. Like, I enjoyed that. Like, me as an individual, I enjoyed that. I think it had a very promising beginning, especially, you know, I love when a song opens with like an ethnic vocal, and this definitely did. So much credit to those backing vocalists, because they sounded fantastic really through this whole thing. Um, when the, 
when the woman with the black hair opened and then a couple of the other two split into harmonies after that. Um, that was really cool. The song itself was interesting. I mean, clearly he was upset because the, the woman did not want him, but he was like, I don't care. I don't care, we're gonna be together. And then he choked the girl. So <laughs> no, I know it's a stage performance. I get it, it's a concept, but it was interesting. It was definitely something you don't see a lot at Eurovision, so you know. If anything, it was definitely that. But his voice was actually quite good too. I don't think his voice got a chance to blossom until like the end of the song, but like after everything shifted to red and got really dramatic, his voice definitely picked up when he started singing uh, higher in his register and then also belting notes, holding them out longer. It definitely, especially that last note when the music cut out and he held it a little bit longer. I really liked that. Um, and of course, I love the Polish dress. I love the Polish styling. Um, and I like the choreography too. I mean, especially, you know, if you're gonna sing a song about that, like, I guess it fits that it got a little dramatic toward the end. But anyway, overall, I like this. I, I don't know that 10th for the bottom, from the bottom was a proper place for this. I think I could see it being a little higher than that. Um, I liked it. I'm, again, I'm interested to hear what other people think. I know some people might not like this, but I actually liked it a fair bit. So go Poland, but I cannot wait to see y'all as we continue reacting because I know there are some Polish performances coming up that I really, really, really love and cannot wait to react to. So anyway, let me know what you think. Comment below as always, please. Like this video, it really helps me. I really appreciate it. And I appreciate y'all as always. And please consider subscribing if you haven't. We're doing the bottom 10 this week. We're doing our off week next week. And then we'll be in 2011 already. It's crazy. So anyway, thank you for clicking on this video. Thank you for watching this video. And as always, I'll see you next time.